and even as we engage in public discourse on matters that are important to the people of Kenya, we must be careful to be factual, lest we become victims of the things we accuse others of doing. I know, you, I know you know what I mean. <laughs> and we are going to work with you and support you to train more science, more mathematics. Um, and finally, because this great institution is run by the Catholic Church, and you know, in the Lord's uh, Creed, we all say we believe in the one <laughs> holy Catholic Church. Even those, <laughs> even those of us who profess other faiths. But because you stand out, it is my request because I have been to many denominations by virtue of the work I do. I've been to many churches and I find that in some of the churches, in some of the denominations, they do not have as many qualified clergy. I want to ask Tangaza that recognizing that many other faiths also believe in the Holy Catholic Church that you also help train clergy for other churches so that so that so that our christianity is founded on solid understanding and knowledge of the word of god And as you do so, remember that Tangaza has nurtured a culture of innovation within its community. I am confident that each and every one of you carries the spirit of innovation, a key to our shared future and resilience, efficiency, and prosperity. Regardless of the field you pursue, innovation will enable you to tackle complex problems offer sustainable solutions and create lasting value. As Tangaza University graduates, you are called upon to lead with imagination and courage, to envision a better world, and to act boldly to bring that vision to life. Today marks not only the end of one stage in your educational journey, but also the beginning of a new chapter filled with limitless possibilities. As you join the distinguished community of Tangaza alumni, I urge you to embrace this new face with a commitment to making a positive impact on yourself and ultimately on humanity. Once again, to the graduating class of 2024, my congratulations to you and to your families who have supported you every step of the way. I was earlier informed by one of the students, one of the PhD students here, that this great institution and university, newly chartered, is working on a resource center And they requested me to see what I can do by way of support to that person. I have discussed this with the Minister for Education, and the Kenya government is going to support that resource center with 50 million shillings. And so, Between the management of this great institution and the Ministry of Education, they will work out the mechanics of us working together. And in the same spirit, I want to commend 
the leadership of this great institution and the community of this great institution for the positive change and impact that you're making. I know this institution was once upon a time part of Catholic University and I have a relationship with Catholic University. Some of my children learned there. And so um, in this compound, we've been here many times around this compound. And it is very gratifying that we are here today to do this together. And I want to ask all of us, leaders, the clergy, Kenyans, to work together towards a nation that we can all be proud of. And even as we engage in public discourse on matters that are important to the people of Kenya, we must be careful to be factual, lest we become victims of the things we accuse others of doing. I know you, I know, you know what I mean. <laughs> Finally, go forth, therefore, with the confidence of someone empowered here at Tangaza University, ready to teach minds, to touch hearts, and to transform lives everywhere you go. May God be with you, and may you honor his will by living up to your purpose. God bless you, God bless our great country, Kenya, and God bless Tangaza, Asante Nisa. Let's give applause to His Excellency for such a wonderful speech. Thank you. Your Excellency. At this point, Your Excellency will now move to the conferment of degrees and awards of diplomas and certificates. So allow me to invite Dr. Daniel Kitonga, Deans and Principals of Affiliate Colleges, Chancellor and Moderator, to proceed. Karibu. Doctor of Philosophy, I have the and pleasure to invite the Dean, School of Arts and Social Sciences, to call by name the candidates who have successfully satisfied the requirements for conferment of the degree of Doctor of Philosophy in Social Transformation in their areas of specialization. <laughs> 